I'm Derek Sloboda, Sports Information Director at Chicago State University. Sitting to my right is Toby Renz, new women's volleyball coach at Chicago State. Toby, welcome to Chicago State. Thanks, Derek. Very excited to be here. Excellent. Um, let's let the Chicago State faithful know a little bit about yourself. What kind of play can we expect from the Cougars? Maybe what kind of coaching style do you have? Well, you know, it's one that's uh, constantly evolving, but um, I always wanted my teams to be known for their hard work ethic and, um, you know, that relentless pursuit um, and the never give up approach and um, keep battling for every single point. And um, we will embody that definitely and just uh, going to be a matter of time. You, uh, you grew up in Iowa, but you've coached on the East Coast for a little bit. What drew you to this uh, position at Chicago State? Yeah, well, as uh, my family was quick to point out, uh, this is the closest I've been to home um, since I really embarked on and coaching at the Division One level. And, you know, sometimes you can't always pick and choose where you, you land. And uh, for me, it, this I thought was an incredible opportunity. This is a, as close that I've been to home, um, you know, since I really started coaching even as an assistant. And um, I, I've had some amazing experiences and uh, I'm, I'm really, really pleased and happy with the idea of being in Chicago, um, that much closer to home. I grew up in Iowa, and you know, so it's a, a car ride home on the on the long weekend, on a rare weekend, I should say, um, that we have as coaches. But uh, it's kind of nice to know that's in, in my backyard now. You're kind of part of a new era here in Chicago State Athletics with us going to the WAC next year. What did that mean to your choice coming here? What do you think it means to the program in general? It, honestly, I, I was pleasantly surprised when I came here to interview. Um, you know, at not only the vision and direction that the program wants to go, um, but really with the facilities and, and location, proximity to everything Chicago and the city has to offer. And it, it's one thing to look over something on the internet, but then when you come here and you experience it firsthand, um, I think that coupled with the people that I came into contact uh, with, I, I think the more the volleyball community sees that, they're going to be really impressed with what we have to offer. Now we've talked shop a little bit here, but let's get a little personal. Let's talk favorite book, favorite movie, and favorite TV show. Ooh, favorite book. Um, yeah, usually it's the most recent read, and I uh, actually read one lately called Wheat Belly, um, and it's really about genetically altered food, and so I'm, I've always been kind of opposed to that, and I always try to eat pretty healthy, and so it, along that line, uh, it's, it's Wheat Belly. Um, and then the TV show... Boy, it's uh, there's not a lot of volleyball TV shows to choose uh, from. Not too many volleyball reality TV shows. Uh, Friends was always a good one, um, and I'm, I'm not a huge TV buff, if you will. But um, I'll probably leave it at that, I guess. <laughs> Any movie that sticks out to you? That boy, when you see it on TV, you always stop and watch. I go real old school here, and I'd have to say St. Elmo's Fire is one uh, really good one. It's, it's a classic now, I guess, as they would call it. But And now you're coaching kids who probably don't know of it. Probably have not heard of it, but worth worth digging up, you know, and they, they can rent it on Redbox. And, um, but it, it's, it's, it's a good flick. Well, the nice thing is you have plenty of time on some bus rides to throw it in, yeah, yeah. and then you can you can let the, the student athletes complain or tell you if they like it or not. Yeah. we got time to do that. And I'm uh, sure I'll get their opinion one way or the other. You, know. you always do, don't you? Toby, welcome to Chicago State. Thanks. Thank you very much. All right. Thank you.